the southern Appalachians have the greatest diversity of salamanders in the entire world. So literally this is one of the best spots on the planet to study salamanders. And especially some of the ones that inhabit the Weir Dam, the four-toed salamander. Um, in Tennessee it's a species that's been deemed in need of management. It's also a species that's considered of greatest conservation need. So we need to gain as much data and as much knowledge about this animal as we can to ensure its uh, existence. So one of the reasons we're here is the TVA um, side of the South Holston Weir Dam has a large population of four-toed salamanders. Um, in fact, probably one of the best in eastern Tennessee. So because the animals are here and TVA has provided ideal habitat for many, many years for these animals, it draws us here to study their behaviors. The project we're engaged in with uh, Tennessee Valley Authority and TVA is a terrific project and we're excited to be a partner in it uh, with TVA in, in regards to uh, salamander research and the, uh, the impact in that in the region. What we're trying to do is look at spatial and nesting behavior of these salamanders. So what we really want to gain is an understanding of where they're spending the majority of their time um, during the summers and then when they come to the spring breeding cycles. So tonight we'll be out uh, l literally looking for these animals and trying to locate them. We also have animals with transponders inside of them. And what we're able to do is use new radio technology and pick up these animals underground. So that also allows us to mark their underground movements that normally aren't visible um, unless you have that equipment. I think it's important to understand who you're sharing land with, who's your neighbors, and I think uh, it's a pretty cool thing we're doing here. You know, we're so fortunate to have this cooperative agreement with TVA, not only with our assistance in the grant, but especially just providing us with a hands-on laboratory. You know, it's, it's impossible to produce these conditions um, on a college campus um, anywhere. So by TVA allowing us to come out, we can give our students hands-on experience with these animals with field experience that they typically cannot get in classroom settings. Typically this kind of extensive field research doesn't occur uh, in the third year of, of senior institutions or even graduate work. And so as a result of that, uh, this unique situation, uh, Virginia Holland Community College students are able to experience something pretty unique in their educational experience that otherwise wouldn't be possible without TVA and the partnership that we have.